What's up, timekeepers? Me, Tom Gamer here, bringing another part of Beholder. So, if ready, I'm ready, Tom, to roll the intro. Alright guys, so today I'm bringing you another episode of Beholder. Hopefully you guys are enjoying the series. I only played one episode, but that was pretty fun. I like the whole concept of uh, trying to find people for uh, sort of this totalitarian uh, environment that I have to get rid of people doing stuff they're not supposed to. I got new stuff, I got new rules coming in every time that I have to look out for and things like that and I mustn't get caught at the same time. So we'll keep going. I uh, have a new mission. I played a bit already last time, but I didn't. I, I kept that part of the video for this video. So the beginning of that video is going to be apart from the last video, last time I recorded, and then then we'll get back to this part here. So let's go. Call, dial the number, report the task to ministry. Mr. Order, congratulations! Your task was success. As a reward, we are transferring the following sum of your account. Ooh! Oh shit! Remember, if you miss a call from the Ministry, or you'll be fined. You must be in the apartment at all time. Uh, answer the phone when it rings. Okay. And if you're dying, do you understand? Yes. You get rid of Violator, and I'll survey your tenant's opinion on Shimmer. Find out what other people think about him. Document him characteristic after you're done with the survey. Go to get to work. Good afternoon. Uh, I want to ask you about Klaus Shimmer. Do you? Does he bother you? He's a person of worth. He helped me acquire acquired a nice bottle of Xerex. He's an expert in wine, unlike my grandpa. Hey, yeah, that's good to hear. That's good to hear. Mark Rannick. Let's talk to Mr. Rannick. What do you want, activist? Uh, talk to Claus Zimmer. Talk about Claus Zimmer. What do you want to know? Talk about the order. About the order. Uh, it's my duty. I've seen Claude buying modeling kits at the store. They have no kids. I thought it was a gift. After that, I saw him wrap the box in paper and run home. Thought I'd buy it for himself. Thanks, Mark. Big help. Hello. That's about the husband. How's your husband doing? He looks upset. He doesn't feel well. He received a parcel and a reel of film. Uh, Claude's like taking photo. This will cheer him up. Uh, profile attendant, Mr. Claus Shimmer, living in apartment 01, male, martial status, lives with uh, Maria Shimmer, occupation, uh, tobacco salesman, okay, uh, tobacco salesman, uh, huh? Okay, dope. All right, send the report. That's a lot of moolah. All right, uh, call the ministry and report the completion of task. All right, all right, family man, family guy. Call the ministry. Dial a number. Call the ministry. Ministry, it's time to act, comrade. You must evict uh, Claude Shimmer. Uh, why? How can I evict Shimmer? Talk to Shimmer. If we find him moving out, we'd be fine with him moving out. It would be better if you report him when he violates our directives. It's our duty, Comrade Carl. Ask about Shimmer's wife. What will happen to his wife? We don't care about her. Do what you think is best. Jesus Christ. Alright. Talk to you later. Okie dokie. Alright, uh, find a way to evict Claus Shimmer from apartment one. Hello, Mr. Shimmer. Hello! What do you need? Tell me straight, Carl. Do you receive an assignment to spy on me? Uh, bleh, huh. Um, end conversation. Bye! <laughs> okay, let's go talk to Mr. Shimmer again here. Alright, hello! What do you need? Tell me straight, Carl. Uh, yeah, I'll be straight with him. You must be, you must be more careful, Comrade Claus. I'll get right to the point. I've received an order to evict you from the building. What? They want to evict me from my apartment? That's unthinkable. If I could, I would have left this pokey hole a long time ago. 
Well, my problem shouldn't bother you. Thanks for the warning. What are you going to do? Uh, offer help? I want to help you? Why don't you leave the city? This is super su suspicious, Carl. Why would you care about me? Insist on ta of talking? I'm not asking out of curiosity. I want to help you. I'm being hunted. It's hard to believe anyone is interested in my troubles. I was sent to a tobacco shop to this tiny wooden booth near the fish market. They took my absentee certificate without it. I'm stuck here, you understand? What's an absentee certificate? You should know such thing. Carl, this is the document you need to either enter a stra strategic facility or leave the city. Railway station ports and road with checkpoints are all close to me. Okay, why don't you take it? You won't believe me. I received a response from the ministry. The documents were sent to the archives from the data update. They said I could obtain them there. I went to the archive. They said there is no document left. I spent a week in the line to see an inspector about submitting detection application. Two months later, I was told I'm used to wrong form for my application, and they were out of the ones I needed. Damn it. You mean the documents are lost in the archives? Yes, the documents are in the archives. They, s they said it's a ploy to drive visitors crazy. I don't know if that's a joke or not. The Ministry of Distribution has clean hands. There's nothing we can do about the archives. Okay. Let's see what I can do about the absentee certificate. Alright. Um, claw shimmer... Action requirement. Obtain a shimmer paper from the archives. I'll see what I can do here, but... Oh, uh, it is legal to wear and sell jeans. What? How do I know if they're wearing jeans? Everything's dark. Now, how the fuck am I supposed to find, uh, obtain shimmer from the papers from the archive? Somebody works for the archive, or? Uh, no. Uh, cafeteria cook. Uh, ar archive employee, so Mark Rennick. Mark Rennick. Rennick is apartment three. So apartment three is over here. Mark, Rennick, Rennick, Mr. Rennick, what do you want from me, Archivist? Uh, uh, do you do you work in the archive, old man? What is it to you? You know this even, this even without me. I need your help. One good man can't obtain a document from the archives. What are you talking about? Documents of good people aren't taken to the archives. Don't feed me a line. Tell the true story about Claus. I'm talking about Shimmer from Apartment One. He fell from grace with the state. They took his absentee certificate, and now he's stuck here. I don't like him. He works in the tobacco shop but has never given me tobacco for free. He behaves like this and speaks rudely because he's afraid. Help me, bring me his absentee certificate. They can't live without it, understand? Deal, but you owe me a bottle of whiskey. I won't be able to access the, the confiscated document without it. Okay, you want fucking... Uh, talk about, yes, uh, you bring me whiskey, here's the bottle of whiskey, keep quiet, good choice. I got the paper, come back later. Yeah, you better. Okay, Mark. One for me, Archivist. Uh, help Shimmer, okay. Here's the paper, these ar archive rate. Those archive rat lost it. I found it. You're awesome, dude. Thank you very much. Hello. Talk about the documents. I still can't believe that you decided to help us. Any news? You're a free person now. Incredible, you did it. Now, nothing will prove from leaving. I'm afraid it's not good. My wife tried to buy train tickets, but they didn't sell them to her. Seems we're being blacklisted. We must find a way to leave the city and get as far away from it as we can. Or even leave this country. Can you help? I'll try to think of something. At least it's a blacklist and not a list of people to be executed. My gratitude knows no bounds. I started believing people when I met you. Jesus Christ. You're asking for a lot, my old man. What do you want? Get acquainted. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Carl. I'm the new manager of the apartment building. Jones Patanedo. Bussin on coal barge. Okay, I'm preparing for a long trip. We're sailing abroad. While I work as a trainee for the outside affairs committee, I'll leave you I'll leave, I'll live in your cell. What kind of what kind of training? This training is obligatory for everyone who travels abroad and foreign business. We're talking anti propaganda training, okay? Are you alone? Yes, I live alone. Uh special offers. I have a deal. Time is hard, hard. Everyone is doing their best. I have canned fish. You know everyone around here. Find me a buyer and I'll pay you generously. Ask about quality of the food. 
Uh, turn, okay, I guess. Try sell the canned food. Wonderful. Here's a crate of 50. Whoa, I don't. Can. Can sell them for 100 piece and then market them. Great cost. You give me three and then I'll sell it all whenever you make above three grand is yours to keep. Did you note my generosity? 50 cans. Jesus Christ. All right. Isn't it uh, illegal to sell fish here? Uh, it's legal to possess fish. God damn it. My compliments talk about canned food. Do you need imported canned food? The price is 50 a can for 4,000. It's imported? Then why are the cans dented? I'll take it. It's always demand. Come back tomorrow, I'll give you the money then. Strike an agreement with the boss and for shimmers. The bassoon. Oh, is that the uh, fucking... If I sell the canned foods... Oh... I might be good to go. A trip abroad. Uh, you're leaving a house soon? I have that right? Yes, we're about to leave. The bear... The barge is ready. We're waiting for the outside affairs. We're going to introduce the crew. Where are you heading? Uh, to the bay to the south and towards New Zealand. Have you been there? No, not the city. It's our straight port city that has free governance for the last decade. We'll stay in the port for a week, download coal, and take take walks. Let's see them. Uh, oh, Mr. Rear. Jones, can you t take Shimmer with you on the round? Help me sell those canned goods, and I'll, then we'll talk. Okay, now, we, now we're going somewhere. Now we're going somewhere. My compliments. Uh, talk about the canned food. I'm waiting for my money for the as agreed. Your canned food isn't selling well. It's hard to get rid of. I'll ma I made no money. Here's an avalanche with almost half of that money. Say thank you even. Say thank you even for this. Jesus Christ. Did I get did I get gift? That would happen. I can't. I dare you. It's only we agreed to twice as much. Framed me. What's next? I give you a crate full of cans and you give and you give me money? Uh, keep the matter quiet. Pay what you owe. Mm. How dare you talk to an officer of the state that way, sailor. I'll pay you for this bugger. Damn it, I might have fucked up a bit. Uh... Mmm, that's not good. I've just fucked up big time. Uh, what directive is this? 6052. Guess we're gonna have to evict him since I sort of fucked up, so. From September 12th. I'm going to have to invict him, unfortunately. This foreign salt. Okay. Sorry, Mr. Boom. Oh, well. So many cops car for. Fuck's going on. Whoa. What the fuck happened? Everything's broken. God damn it. Oh my god. Uh, pick up the phone. Emergency call. Ministry. Ministry of order. The unrest in the city. It's dangerous to go outside. Stay calm and repair anything. The house that's broken. You have two days. Really? I have two days? What the fuck? His father, uh... Can't bear it anymore. D Dad, another day in the mine. I'll hang myself. What do you suggest? I want to leave the country, Dad. If I stay here, I'll eventually... 
cease to be human. I can feel myself becoming dumber every day and there's no way I'll leave. I'll ever get out of this. Where are you going? One of my co-workers told me they need of my profile. My profile experts in North Korea. The same profile I had in the university, I'll be able to graduate and get my good job there. North? Are you sure it's not North Berea? South Berea? Isn't it the same? Poor little minor. Too bad they didn't teach you geometry in the university. North and South Berea are two different planets. That's not funny, Dad. Okay, how much do you need? Ten thousand. Oh my god, I'll see what I can do. Are you kidding me right now? What happened? Uh, they're here to get me. Oh no. What are you guys doing? Hmm. Oh, did they take my boy away? Oh. God damn it. They took my family. <laughs> Sir, can we bring you sad news? Your son, Parasite, took part of a central bank robbery and was killed by police. Uh, since your son is under age, he'll fine for damage. Oh, fuck. Really? Really? God damn it. The entire neighborhood came to see Carl dragged into the police car. His face was covered with blood, and his pants had a hole where his building keys had been, as the police had torn them out with a fabric. To the bitter end of their short life, Carl wondered what happened to his family. Ah, oh, that is sad. No one from Carl Stein's family was destined to leave to the end of the year. All right, guys, that's going to be it for a Beholder. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this part. So, uh, yeah, we'll start. We'll maybe start a new game. I don't know yet. We'll see what happens. And uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Of course, if you enjoyed the video, like the video, subscribe to the channel. We really appreciate that. Follow me everywhere. Me Time Gamer, Twitter, Twitch, Facebook, Instagram, and right here, YouTube.com forward slash Me Time Gamer, where I post a new video every day of the week, Monday to Friday, 3 p.m. Eastern Time. Sorry about that. Monday to Friday, 3 p.m. Eastern Time. But thank you so much, guys, for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Keep on keeping on.